it is your boy, Massful27. Excuse the there. It is community day today, and it's yeah, that fun one that we've uh, we've all been talking about. Let's just have a quick check. Let's see if I can be inspired for this one. No, no, not really. It's raining outside. This does not feel like a, a good day for Con Day. Well, it's a good job we've got a really, really exciting Pokemon to take part on today to give us a reason to drag ourselves outside. Oh no. Again, it's Swablu Community Day. Let's let that one take a minute to sink in. Obviously, We've got to appreciate it is an opportunity for some people to get a new shiny if they haven't got Swab Blue. But we've talked this one through on Check It Out Incense, a Pokemon Go podcast. We've we've pretty much nailed this one. We've we've held this one over the Bunsen burner and uh, we've pretty much dismissed this one. However, it would be very easy not to do a vlog. So this is a vlog, this is Swab Blue community. We're gonna do something different this time around. I'm normally out there flying around trying to do it, but we're gonna play this one in a very different way. But we are going to do a very quick check and we are going to load ourselves up with some incentives because we're going to play this one on the gotcha i think that's, that's the one thing we're going to do this is going to be a fun one we're going to give this zero actual attention other than what we're doing right now let's see it's a normal blue one there's a great bonus though for this one that we all spoke about is the egg quarter egg distance hatching now we did make a really good point but there might be worth it might be worth putting on some of those seven kilometer eggs for this event. Well, the best, most exciting part has just joined us at the start of this one. It's actually Galarian Ponyta. So Galarian Ponyta, Charlie Pops, 1982. Thank you for the invite. We're gonna have this at the very beginning of this one. Something I didn't plan for actually. But Galarian Ponyta has been unlocked now because we hit the 500 billion trillion zillion billion fairy type Pokemon that we had to catch. It's obviously been released to Shiny. I've been very impressed with the amount of encounters, actually. You can get them on AR scanning tasks, and you can also get them or catch 15 fairy type. They are the researches or the tasks that will give you the encounter with Galarian Ponytar. Now it has been unlocked. There's a little bit of time left before this one disappears, but we're gonna have another good go at it. So I've, I've grinded a little bit more since we did the podcast. I've done 17 or 18 encounters now with Glowing Potter. They have increased the odds on this as well, which is always very handy. So let's see if we can uh, have a bit of shiny sparkles at the beginning of this in a more exciting fashion. But yes, Swablu Con Day. We're gonna be playing this one on the gotcha. It's the only thing to do. <sighs> this is gonna be our friend today. We're going to see how we do. And we're going to do a tally at the end. As we all know, I am the rural player, the rural player of the gang. And uh, we're not going to use that as any reason to bust any of guts over this one. We're going to see if a gotcha con day can generate anything better. So my record is 23 on a con day over here in the country. So uh, that's pretty good going. We're going to see if the gotcha can do anything more today. So Ponyta is down. Let's start this edition with a nice little shiny check. Two more than I thought we were going to have. And then we're going to find the gotcha up. We're going to load all our incenses. And then we're going to go. And it isn't shiny, unfortunately. A 1936. I am actually collecting all these ones because I want to see how many. Because I always lose track of how many I've got. Let me know in the comments below. Have you got shiny Galarian Ponyta? Yeah, I've seen a lot of them on Twitter. I think it's one in 65. Something like that. The odds on that one. So that is a lot more increased. And there we go, that's another one in the bag. So we're gonna quickly check these Swablus here. We're gonna whack the incenses on and we're gonna let the gotcha do absolutely everything on this one. And we're gonna see what tally we do. So let's quickly fire these on. Incense, bang. Three hours for a minute, there wasn't orange. I was a little bit concerned. Bang. <laughs> it's gonna be one of those days. As we get a little rogue spoink there, we'll quickly check the one on the incense. It'd be lovely to get some yellow sparkles. But as we were saying before, there is not a lot of excitement for this one. However, however, we have got triple catch XP, so the gotcha will be working itself for me on that one. But that is about it. Yeah, that is about it for this Swap Blue community today. So when I see you next, we're gonna check the gotcha See what the totals are, and we'll go from there. 
See you in a bit, guys. Well, we've been foiled today. Uh, if it wasn't the fact that I ran out of poker balls, I then have run out of balls. We're the last few ultra balls. But first of all, playing at home in this way has been absolutely brilliant. We have lasted nearly four and a half hours on what I'd stashed up together. We saw the mighty Leeds United win today, 4-0 against Burnley. And just so we've got some sparkles on this edition, ta-da! <laughs> there they are. There they are. We've got a shiny swarm blue and I've got three balls left to catch this one. So let's just not take any risk. Let's quickly get it on a pineapple. Boom in on there. And I'm going to do a very, very quick stay at home shiny tally on this swab blue community day. I'm quite impressed that we've lasted so long. Let's see if we've got anything decent. Let's look at the numbers. My previous record, I think I said was 23 staying at home. Well, let's quickly ivy check this shiny just very quickly. Absolutely awful. That's a shame. Are we going to get another We on the one there? Let's quickly check these ones with two balls left. And then we're going to go into the tallies because I think it just disappeared, actually, the one on the sport. But we've had a really, really good day. It's been interesting. It's freed up my hands, actually. I've got you to do it for so long. It's been a very lazy one. And you guys will totally get probably why I've decided to at least capture it in this way. So let's look at the totals. This is what you lot want to see. How many shiny Swablu did we get on this community day? I've got a feeling... It wasn't as strong as we could have been. There we go. 3, 6, 9, 12, 13. Shiny Swab Blue. So there you go. The rural player. He said it there. The rural player in me has struck 13. Unlucky 13 there. Now, have we got any hundos? Have we got anything that's worth putting this move on? I'm not really going to get too excited. About it. No, we haven't. No, nothing on there. Anything solid? A shiny freestyle would be really handy. No, we haven't got anything there. Oh, this is depressing. Well, let's just do the shiny, because I like to get the shiny evolutions on these editions. Any two-star shinies in there on the swab blue? There we go. Ironically, the very, very first one. So let's evolve this one into Altaria. It's done. It's an alternative way of playing Community Day. And Altaria shiny, in this way, kind of feels like it's the right thing to do. And there we go. Another one for the collection. I know we're a bit harsh on this on our podcast, but it is what it is. There it is, Shiny Altaria. And that learns Moonblast, which is the exclusive move on this. But hey, I'm not a PvP player. And we're not going to go too much into that one. But there we go. There's the evolution. A one-line evolution, which made it slightly underwhelming. However, it can be mega evolved. And the reason I the reason I didn't go out and do the tasks for this community, I'm going to be honest, I wanted to play it at home anyway was I want to try and get shiny Galarian Ponytail. That's a priority for me today. So I'll wait to those spot on um, the spot. Um, I think I can't get my words out. Wait till the research on the um, stops reset themselves. And that'll be quite handy. Now we're going to tap on this final one here and then we're going to wrap this one. I hope you've enjoyed this alternative community today. I'm Asphalt27. Thank you for checking out this edition. Let me know in the comments below how you do on your Swablu community days. Did you go hard? Or a bit like me to just take it very, very easy. The big one, the big one for June is we have got Gibble. Com day. It's already been announced. It's massive. It's divided opinion. Your boy here is very happy with that one. We want Gibble Community Day. We're going to hit that one absolutely hard. 
It'd be lovely to get some shiny sparkle gibbles and we'll be doing a far better edition for Gibble Com Day. You mark my words. Well, that is it. That is a wrap. Thank you for checking this one out. I'll see you guys later in the week for Spotlight Hour. Be safe, gang.